In this tutorial, you will learn how to assign paging priority and adjust paging volume with the TOA 9000M2 GUI software application. Before we start, it's important to keep in mind that paging priority is stored in global memory. This means that paging settings will remain regardless of scene changes. This is helpful in many cases. For example, if a user turns down the master volume in a particular room, an important page from a priority microphone will consistently operate with the same programmed behavior and volume no matter what. First, you may open the priority setting view by clicking the priority button. You may also find this in the setting menu. Next, you may assign a priority with a level 1 through 3 to any input. 1 is the highest priority and 3 is the lowest priority. A blank assignment indicates no priority. Next, you can indicate if the, this priority input will be triggered by a Vox threshold. This means that the input will be triggered when an audio signal exceeds a certain threshold. Keep in mind that in order to use the Vox, the channel's gate setting must be turned on. See our video on gate settings to learn more about how to turn a channel's gate on. Next, set the ducking level. The ducking level is the amount that the source will be reduced when a signal of a higher priority is activated. In this example, when a page comes in through channel 1, channel 2 will be ducked by 40 decibels. To adjust the paging volume, click the paging volume button. As mentioned earlier, these volume settings are independent of normal output volume settings. <laughs> 